kids are right next door. Oh, I just came to say hi for a sec. Hey, what time are they leaving? I told you my parents are still at home and the party does not start till nine. So, we're really doing this tonight, right? Yeah. <laughs> Come on, say it, just so I can hear it, just so I know. We're really doing this tonight, Mitch. Oh my God, that's like so cool. <laughs> okay, idiot, you have to go. Jenny? Yeah? Alvin's here. Ah, oh, yeah, one sec. You go hide. Um, I'm coming in one sec. You get down there and you shut up, okay? Yeah. Oh, hey, Alvin. Hi, Jenny. Is there any way to treat your math tutor, Jenny? Wake up. Uh, I think he'll be just fine. Right, Alvin? Oh, yeah, no, no problem. Your mother and I are leaving at 5 p.m. sharp, okay? You're gonna have one friend over Max. And it better not be that idiotic boyfriend of yours. Idiotic? It's gonna be what? me and April watching movies. Good. We trust you, Jenny. No parties, okay? You hear me? Yes. No parties. You look really beautiful today, Jenny. Yeah, doesn't she, though? Now, the question is, what do you call my girlfriend pretty for, nerd? Uh, I'm sorry, I I, 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 I... I... You're her tutor, right? So tutor her. Don't worry about what she looks like. Mitch, stop. Look, <clears throat> my brother's getting us the liquor. I texted everybody I know. Tonight's gonna be insane. <laughs> okay, Mitch, shut up and go. <sighs> Later, dweeb. I'm sorry about that. Um, you said you're gonna have a party? Yeah, just a few close friends. Cool, cool. Close friends, that's, uh, of course, yeah. Cool. Alvin? Hmm? Do you wanna come to my party tonight? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'd love to. Man, a real high school party, huh? Okay, but you need to be cool, okay? Just you, no nerdy ass friends, you understand? No friends. Yeah. Cool. 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 I'm cool. Um, what do I wear? Are you sure you're ready for this? The party? Hell yeah. You know what I'm talking about, Jenny. I'm 17. Everyone around me is doing it, so why shouldn't I? Look, losing your virginity, it's a big deal. Are you positive you wanted to be with Mitchell Foster, the king of the idiots? Look, he's not exactly who I pictured while like thinking of this, but he's cool, he's popular, he's really hot, and he wants to. And he's been patient with me. Jenny, that's not an excuse for you to have sex with him. I mean, just tell him you want to wait. Oh, hey guys. So? Are you ready to party? Yeah! Let's get this party started. your dress. You're like a sexy ladybug. Thank you. <laughs> Should we go? No.
Where the hell are you? We, we have to start cleaning now. What happened last night? I don't know. That punch was so damn strong. I'm pretty sure I puked in one of your mom's plants. My head is killing me. Yeah, well, I'd be worried if it wasn't. Now tell me, how was it? What? You know, it. I... I think it was good. I, I don't really remember. What is he still doing here? Alvin, buddy! It's time to wake up, you need to go. Oh, what is this feeling? Let's go hangover. I don't like it. You need to go, now! Okay, one sec. I gotta find my glasses. So, I guess I'm no longer... I guess so. You're no longer a virgin, Jenny Jorkowski. Wow. Yep. Now grab a broom and help me before your parents get here and ground you for the rest of your period of little life. True, thanks. What's going on? What's so important you couldn't tell me over the phone? Not here. Okay. Jesus, Jenny, you're, you're scaring me. What's going on? I'm late. What? I'm late. And I'm never late. Oh my God. Okay, if you're so scared, then do a pregnancy test. I did. This could be a mistake. We could try another one just to be sure. It's the fifth test, April. The fifth? That's, that's a lot of tests. What'd I do? Well, you could take care of it. You're joking. You know, I do not believe in abortions. Okay, then you're gonna need to tell Mitch and your parents and then give birth to a human baby. What's going on? Uh, you okay? I have something to tell you, but you can't get mad. You didn't like sleep with my brother or something, did you? Mitch! I didn't get my period this month, so I went to buy a pregnancy test and it was positive. So I went to see my doctor. I'm pregnant. Shut up. You're joking, right? You're serious. Jenny, you, you can't have this kid. Mitch. No, Jenny, listen to me. We, we gotta go to the clinic now and, and, and get rid of it. I mean, th this could ruin my life, our, our lives. I can't do that. No, we're, we're, we're going right now. Hey, look at me. I didn't want this either. But you're not gonna tell me what I should do with my body. I should have never slept with you. Yeah, but you did. I have a scholarship. I'm leaving next year. We'll figure it out. That's what people do. How did this happen? I thought we used protection, but I, I don't remember anything. Do you? Jenny. 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 What are we gonna do? 
We're gonna tell our parents and we'll go from there. Would you like to be a dad? Uh, um, I, what? I don't know. Maybe one day. Would you like imagine yourself being a dad? Uh, um, I, I guess I should. I, I would have to find a woman that could tolerate me first. <laughs> Yeah, you got that right, Alfalfa. You could never get a girl like Jenny. You probably couldn't even knock a girl up. <laughs> I can't wait to see our beautiful baby. You can't get better genes than this. You just can't. I gotta take a leak. <laughs> what would you like to watch? I need to tell you something. Something wrong with the baby? I did something terrible, April. Actually, something unforgivable. What did he do? Mitch is not the father. Um, what? He's not the dad. Oh, okay, then who, who is it? Alvin, please tell me you're joking. So you told Mitch he's the father and you know he isn't? Yeah. Okay, so you just secure your place in health and <laughs> that's great. I didn't know what should I do. Everybody's gonna laugh at me at school. You need to tell him the truth like now. You've been lying to him this whole time? I didn't know what to do. I can't be with Alvin. I can't. So you lied. So people wouldn't know you slept with Alvin. Yeah. Okay. I need to go. What? I need you right now. Are you joking? Okay. I can't talk to you until you tell Mitch and Alvin the truth. I need you. What did I say, Jenny? The truth, it's always better. You're an adult now and a mom to be soon. So you better act like it. April, wait, please. I don't even know what to say. Mitch. <laughs> don't touch me! You, you cheated on me. You cheated on me with, with that, that, that loser and, and you lied and... I loved you. Ready? We have to talk. You and me. Yeah. How? I don't know. Mm. Um, why didn't you tell me? Because if, uh, people find out, you know. <laughs> Am I that much of a loser?
No, you're not, Alvin. I'm the liar. I'm the loser. And you're a great guy. I don't know how I'm gonna live with myself after all of this. You're gonna be fine. I am going to be with you every step of the way. I mean, it's my baby too, right? I'm gonna be here for you, I promise. We are gonna give this kid a great life, right? Will you ever forgive me? I was never mad at you, Jenny. I fell in love with you ever since you gave me a wedgie in fourth grade. I mean, I still don't get how I get to talk to you. Mom, Dad, it's not... I think... I think I'm pregnant. How can you be so stupid? Who did this to you? Nobody. I mean, my, my boyfriend. Look, it, it's not a big deal, okay? What do you mean it's not a big deal? Do you have any idea how this is gonna affect us? What is everyone gonna think? You know Abigail, this is a small town. Our friends from church, our neighbors. Your dad can lose his job. I didn't even know you had a boyfriend. You're just a kid. Didn't you always want a grandchild? Yes, but not from a pregnant teenager. What's his name? I'm going to kill him. Dad, please stop. It's not his fault. You are not going to keep that thing. What? You're not ready for this. You in a high school. Who's gonna pay for it? We can't afford another child. Let's just think about this. She can go to my sister's place until she gives birth, and then we can take the child for adoption. But what we will tell to everyone when they ask where she is? We'll think of something. Maybe we can say she's at the boarding school. No! I don't want to go. I want to stay here. And I don't want to give up the baby. I want to keep it. Abigail, you need to be rational here. No! I'm keeping it. You wanna keep? Fine. You wanna throw everything away to be a struggling teen mom? And get out! Gabe, please. Get out now! Babe, I need to talk to you. Yeah, okay, just one minute. I'm almost finished with the game. Buster, it's important. Okay. What's up? W what is it? It's a pregnancy test. For who? God, Buster, it's mine. I'm pregnant. No, it's not mine. What are you? Of course it is. I haven't been with anyone else. Look, I just got into my dream school and I'm leaving in just a couple of months. Okay, but what about the baby? What about me? Look, I don't know. Look, I don't even care. Just get an abortion. I don't want to. I want to keep it. You it's have to. You just get... Bro, calm down. Let go of her. Don't tell me what to do. Listen, if my parents find out, they're going to kill me. Buster, I don't even know where to go for that. Look, just look it up. This is your problem, not my problem. I don't want an abortion. I want to keep it. 
It's my baby. Our baby. Our baby? You're kidding. This is your baby. I don't even want it. And just get out. Look, no, we never even think. Never even liked you anyway. Fine. Fine. Screw you then. I'll take care of our baby by myself. Dude, you're such an asshole. What do you want? I don't want your pity. Do you have a place to stay? No. My parents kicked me out and, uh, Buster's useless. You can come stay with me if you want. What? Won't, won't Buster be mad? I don't care. Plus, it's cold outside. No. No, I'll find somewhere else. No, your problem, Axel. Look, my parents helped me with my rent, so it's not a big deal. I'm not just gonna leave you here. You can stay with me until you figure everything out. I still feel bad. And what are you gonna do? Sleep on the streets? If you wanna pay me back someday, you can. But, for now, just don't worry about it. Uh, Isn't, uh, worrying bad for the baby? God. I don't even know. I, I don't know anything about being pregnant. Okay, let's go then, and we can figure it out together. One day we'll fly away. Just take my hand. It felt weird to live with my ex-boyfriend's best friend. So this is a new place? Nothing, nothing special? Yeah, it's, it's fine. Hey, can you take that? Yeah. But I had nowhere else to go, and Axel was so nice. Please, uh, sit make yourself comfortable. It. Thanks. Tomorrow hasn't happened yet, so let's just wait and see. Because we're here right now, it's all I'll ever need anyhow. He was so selfless, Buster was never like that. Soon a few days turned into a month, and I started feeling like I actually lived there. Not like I was just some pregnant loser taking up his bed. We were spending a lot of time together. It was nice. Here you go. Oh, God. Thanks. What, the berries? Yeah. Oh, okay. Maybe it was all the pregnancy hormones, but I realized I had feelings for him. What are you doing here? Babe, I messed up. I should have been there for you and the baby. Our, our baby. But you, you said... What about the college? I'm still gonna go to college. But I want to help you too as well. My, my family found out about the baby and they want me to step in. So if I step in, you know, I can, I can still go. Oh my god. Your parents are threatening to not pay for your tuition, is that it? That's why you're here. Screw you. Leave me and my baby alone. Look, I never wanted this. You're ruining my life! I think you better get out of here now. Well, <laughs> you're to a thing now. This is seriously the best you can do. Some pregnant slut. My sloppy seconds, huh? Just chill out. I... No! Guys! Guys, stop!
I need the police now. Now. Hi, we are Abigail's parents. May we come in? Yeah. Sure. <laughs> Thank you. What are you doing here? We should have reached out sooner. I'm sorry about what happened. How we acted. We read it immediately. We didn't know where you were. It's been almost two years. I know we didn't handle things the right way. No, we miss you so much. <laughs> and we want to be in your life. I know. It's going to take time to turn back your trust. Please. Give us a chance to be better parents. We love you. Just please give us a chance. Okay. Okay, I'll, I'll give you that chance. This is Daniel. <laughs> Looks so cute. <laughs> hey, Daniel. What you doing? What are you playing with? What do you want to clean my face with it? <laughs> I guess. It's so cute. Daniel. Yes. So, what did you think? Definitely let us know in the comments. We do read all of them. We are releasing a new Secret Diaries video every week. So be sure to subscribe and ring that notification bell to be the first to see it.